Country music is often about broken hearts, and if you can sing about heartbreak with conviction, you can make a lot of money. Enter Lori Morgan, a country star who is accused of being a real-life heartbreaker. Craig Rivera reports. I knew it was just for temporary. Mm-hmm because I know her top, and it doesn't last long. Kim Light isn't exactly a fan of sexy country songbird Lori Morgan. She says the star, who is now dating a high-powered senator, snatched her man Greg, an Alabama police officer, and then just dumped him. I don't like the way um, it went. I don't have respect for her. I just love country music. I love singing, I love entertaining, and all aspects of it. You know country music, you know the name Lori Morgan. She's had a string of top 10 hits on the country charts, and thanks to her popularity, she hosted the American Music Awards last month. That's why we're all so excited about all the great artists being honored tonight. But the love life of 35-year-old Lori Morgan is more dramatic than any twangy country ballad. She's been married three times. Husband number two died tragically of alcohol poisoning. And husband number three was a bus driver who Lori divorced after only 18 months of marriage. Then last year, Morgan dated Dallas Cowboy quarterback Troy Aikman. Writer Stacy Harris covers country music in Nashville. She's interested in a variety of, of men. All of them she's gone out with have been come from different uh, fields. But mouth still dropped when Morgan announced her new love. He's 52-year-old Tennessee Senator Fred Thompson. Although he was a high-powered lawyer, he occasionally moonlighted as a character actor in blockbuster films like In the Line of Fire and Die Hard 2. So what's your problem, Lieutenant McLean? I believe you had a relationship or have a relationship with a member of the United States Senate. Have a relationship? <laughs> yeah. Well, now that part is true. She just wants to be in a situation where she has some indication that, that there will be some stability down the road in her life. And of course, Fred has always been a very stable guy. The media-savvy Republican wouldn't comment about his relationship with Lori when we ran into him on Capitol Hill. That's uh, a personal matter, and I don't think it has anything to do with our business up here, so uh, I'll pass on that. But one man who has plenty to say about Lori Morgan is Greg Light. According to Light, last May, he and Morgan had an affair after the singer spotted him while he was working security at one of her concerts. Her manager came out to um, and told me that she would like to talk to me for a minute on her bus. She introduced herself and I introduced myself and that's when she asked if I would, you know, be interested in you know, calling her and maybe coming to a cookout that she had at her house. A few days later, Light says Morgan invited him to Nashville. I um, stayed over that night at a hotel and went to a concert that she had at Opryland the next day. Approximately a week later, she, she left and went to Hawaii and um, she called me <coughs> and wanted me to come to Hawaii and she made arrangements and flew me there. <coughs> it's easy to get caught up in that lifestyle. How did I feel? Mm -hmm. well, I didn't like it at all. This is Greg's wife. She says Lori Morgan had her singing the blues. The couple was actually briefly divorced when Greg and Lori met, but Kim says they were trying to work things out. She says Lori almost ruined everything. If it hadn't been for her being a musician and had money, no, I don't think he would have ever been with her. If she was a star and all that, any man would have done it. But according to Greg, the country star soon got tired of her blue-collar lover, and things went sour. The attention wasn't there anymore. She was more caught up in her, her um, job, and she wasn't so much as interested in me. I even asked Greg when he was dating her, I said, do you not think that she picks up a man every time she goes somewhere? And he said, no. Well, I think his decisions change now. Lori Morgan declined to be interviewed for this story. Her publicist said she's a great family person just trying to live her life. Meanwhile, Lori is making appearances with Senator Thompson. And as for Greg and Kim, they're back together again. They've even remarried. But don't expect them to be buying any Lori Morgan albums in the future. And there may be two big reasons Lori Morgan is looking for a stable relationship. Her children.